Hey guys, welcome back. Today it's going to be part three of the trailer build. But first, got to move some junk out of the way. Our kitchen's in a minute. All right, so some of the things I did since the last video is I was able to go ahead and go get one of these jacks and put on it. And in the interest of full disclosure, I've already did most of the floor. What I'll do in this video is the other half and show you how I did it. What I'm using is a notch trowel, pressure sensitive adhesive, and plank vinyl flooring. This particular flooring is from a company called Armstrong. Really nice, high dollar stuff. Freebie. Uh, I would like to use a trowel with a little bit finer notch in it, but this is the only one they had at the time, so that's what I got. And then this is just some stick and stay pressure sensitive glue that you can get at Lowe's, Home Depot, I assume, anywhere like that. So let's start putting it down. Once you get a nice even coat down and trout out, you want to let this sit up and get tacky, you know, 15, 20 minutes, whatever it takes. And then we can start cutting and laying these strips. What I'm going to do on the edges here, I am not going to cut that piece in yet. When I get this wall up and finalized, I'll come on the inside and I'll trim that to fit and glue it down. So that's it, floor is down, 99.9% .9 done, except for that little strip that I'm gonna do after we get the wall up. So, yeah. My hinges in, that's it. Armstrong plank vinyl, bamboo smoke is the color. Yeah, nothing to it. <laughs> 